I have a friend that um, he has asthma, and uh, so he's allergic to, I guess, dog hair and cat hair, and um, you know, co-host my podcast, and you know, we hang out a lot. So um, if I ever did get a dog. Um, I'd have to get one that's hypoallergenic. So this is a quick list of the um, hypoallergenic dogs. Uh, And this is uh, based off of the Asthma and Allergy Foundation of America, which according to them, um, as many as three in 10 people in the U.S. have allergic... reactions to cats and dogs. Um, I was raised in a house filled with cats, so I personally don't um, have any problems with that. But uh, overall, these dog breeds are those that don't shed, um, which means they have a non-shedding coat that produces less dander. They don't have hair, and therefore it's less likely that dander clings to the dog, you know, like those Aztec Uh, Dogs are probably great for, like, if, you know, um, has asthma. But the problem is they're, like, big dogs. I've actually seen those. I I love those dogs. Uh, Or they have short, single-layered coats, meaning that without an undercoat to shed, there's dander coming off the dog and sticking around your home. Um, Okay, one is the Affin Pincher. It's, like, a small, you know, there's small, medium, and large dogs, so I'm going to just be going off of that. The first is the Affin Pincher. I'm, I'm going to switch camera angles, sorry. Okay, the first is the Affin Pincher. The next is the Afghan Hound, which would be a large dog. American Hairless Terrier, would, which would be a medium size. The next is the Basenji, medium size. Beddington Terrier, I think large. Bashan Freeze, I've heard of these. Uh, those are small, of course. Ugh, I don't like those. Those look like rats. Um, Coton de Tulir, uh, small to medium. Giant Schnauzer. Oh, I love their beards. Oh, my God. Irish Water Spaniel. Um, I mean, okay. Um, Kerry Blue Terrier. Um, Legetto Roma Natu. Maltese. Miniature Schnauzer. I've seen those. Peruvian Inca Orchid. Poodle, love those. Portuguese water dogs. Um, Soft coat, Wheaton Terrier, Spanish water dog, standard schnauzer. Okay, so the last is this. Uh, it's like a Af- or Aztec breed. Um, but, anyways, uh, thanks for watching. Like, comment, subscribe. Check out my podcast. Bye.